All right, people, welcome back. More card review. So we are looking at yet another Link Monster. Link Monster for today, Monday card review, and Link Monster for Wednesday card review. And that's really all the Link Monsters as of this moment. So we looked at all the Link Monsters, Link Monster mechanics. And now, next, we're going to go ahead and look at some monsters that are help summon the Link Monsters, hopefully. So today, we are looking at the normal Link Monster. It's not a normal monster itself, but it works with normal monsters. So today we are looking at Link Spider. Link Spider is a Earth Cyber's Link Effect monster. He is Link 1 with his Link mar marker being only at the bottom, which is pretty decent. You know, it's, it's a Link 1, which means that I it's a 1 for 1, which is fine, you know. Uh, and since it points directly down, you just slap it in your extra deck, it points down, and you get an extra deck spot right under it. So... Pretty decent. He only has a thousand attacks out of this, so that's pretty weak. He's probably gonna get crushed. He's, he's gonna get squashed like a spider next turn. But hopefully, <laughs> he serves his purpose of being that link monster, uh, link marker down below, which is it's kind of weird because it's like you use you already ha have one naturally with your extra deck spot, and then you summon Link Spider, and then it'll give you one below it, and it's just like okay, that's still only one. So I don't know. Maybe you can link Link Spider with another Link for another Link summon. Uh, I don't. Know. Uh, he's in material, one normal monster. So, he's not generic generic, he needs a normal monster. So, you know, you summon your Dino Rabbit, Kabazals, or whatever, send it, even, you know. Uh, we As of this moment, we're not sure if you can do Pendulums, but if you can, you can go ahead and, you know, send a Metal Foes, send it back to the extra deck, summon Link Spider, it's not terrible, or whatever normal monsters you want to play. Like, if you're not playing normal monsters, there's no point in playing this Link Spider. And he does have an effect, and his effect has to do with normal monsters, surprise, surprise. So, his effect creeds. Once per turn, you can special summon one level four or lower normal monster from your hand to this card's linked zone. Okay, like I guess it's a, it, it, it's fine. I guess it allows for more plays, you know. But it just doesn't seem like you're really doing too much, you know. The only way I can see this card being like okay and thumbs up more is if you play like unexpected die because you go unexpected die summon the normal monster from your deck. You can conduct your normal summon, then go into Link Spider. With that normal monster that you just special summon. Still haven't conducted your normal summon. Use Link Spider effect. Special summon a normal monster from your hand. Still haven't done your normal summon. Then use your normal summon. You know. So I can be like unexpected die. Special summon like one of my, you know. Um, that Megalo whatever normal monster dinosaur. Or Kabuzos or Sabasaurus. Go into Link Spider. Link Spider summon another normal monster. Normal summon a normal monster. And then bam. Lagi Aradoka. And XC into uh, the the spot under Link Spider. You know. That's. That's really the only way, which is really just a convoluted method because I could just go unexpected die, summon the monster, normal summon, and go into the the Kabuzal in my extra slot. But I guess this play would give you an additional monster because, of course, Link Spider would be in your six monster zone or your extra deck spot. So, yeah, but it's only 1,000 and it's a spot in my extra deck. Like, I, I, I just don't really see the point, it, especially since it's only Link 1. Like, am I supposed to... Like, what am I supposed to do with this? Like, it maybe if its effect was to special summon a normal monster from your deck or summon it from your graveyard, but all it does is just summon the normal monster from my hand. That's just the same... That's literally the same resource, you know? From the hand to the field, it just gives me an additional special summon, but, you know, like, I guess I would literally have to use my normal summon just to bust this out, and all it does is give me a... a but someone from my hand, the same resource thing? I don't know. I don't know. Like, there's plays with this if you're playing normal monsters and if it's situationally needed, but I don't know. I don't see it, especially since it's Link. Well, maybe if it was, like, Link 2 or something like that and gave me more something, but it's really just one for one for one for one for one for one. Everything is one, so I don't get the point. I don't know. Maybe you guys can tell me in the comment section below. Or uh, maybe, you know, let me go ahead and actually click, look at the tips. Maybe it has tips. Uh, let's see. Uh, a list of normal monsters that can be summoned by this effect can be found here. Yeah, the mo no normal monsters that are level 4 lower. Nothing special. Uh, the monster summoned by this effect can be used to link summon a second link spider. Okay. And then, two can be used to link summon a link 2 monster that requires earth cyber types or effect monsters. Okay. So, that, there it is, there it is. So, you special summon a Link Spider, then you use this summon, an old monster, then you summon a Link Spider, another Link Spider, and then you can summon a Link 2 monster that hires Earth, Cybers, 
or effects. So cybers, that's your honeybot. Earth, that's the cyber monster. I mean, that's the the monster that we will be looking at uh, on Wednesday. So there you go. And effect monsters, so that that can count towards um, two of uh, for deco talker. So there you go. There you go. So you you gotta use multiple. All right. I was trying to look at a standalone card, but it just needs multiple of itself just to do anything really. But thank you for that tip. Thank you for the tip uh, on Yu-Gi-Oh Wiki. I really appreciate that because I'm sitting here scratching my head like why. But yeah, there you go. There you go, people. Anyway, this is a, a shorter uh, card review, but you know what? That's fine because there's not too much to talk about when it comes to this monster, this Link Spider. So tell me you guys what you think about Link Spider in the comment section below. So I hope you guys enjoyed this card review. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys next time with another Link Monster, another card to look at. So if you haven't already, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell for notifications. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.